Hello, and welcome to Get Sleepy, where we listen, we relax, and we get sleepy. My name's Tom, and I'm your host. Thanks for joining me here on the show. Tonight's story is all about the simple pleasure of walking, an activity that has been proven to boost mood and even help you sleep better at night. In our story, we'll go for a stroll through a peaceful neighborhood near the sea. After wandering along the boardwalk and watching a magical sunset over the ocean, you'll head home to your beach cottage. Okay, it's nearly time to begin our story. But first, just give your mind a moment to do as it pleases, freely and without resistance. It may well choose to drift back over the day just gone. And if so, you can just let each memory float by and receive its moment of acknowledgement. Just calmly allow your mind to process whatever it needs to. And then let each thought or moment gradually drift away from your attention. The events of the day are now in the past. And whatever else your mind naturally brings to the forefront, you can let go of too. Right here and right now, you are ready to relax and recharge. So, you can invite your imagination to guide you through our story. Let it drift to a far away beach where there's nothing to concern you or cause problems. This is where our story begins. It is a beautiful summer afternoon. You're staying at a beach cottage, which is just a few blocks from the boardwalk and pier. The cottage is the perfect location, close enough for walking and sightseeing in the community. You plan on taking a walk this afternoon and staying out until sunset. But first, you stop in the kitchen for a drink and a snack. Sparkling sunlight beams through the window. It reflects off the glass pitcher on the counter, which is filled with freshly squeezed lemonade. You slowly stir the pitcher with a long silver spoon that clinks against the sides, then pause to inhale the strong citrus scent. As you pour the tart lemonade into an iced drinking cup, your mouth waters in anticipation. Cool and refreshing, the lemonade tastes like summer. After savoring every sip, 
you carefully slice a wedge out of a chilled, seedless watermelon. Neon pink juice squirts from underneath the speckled green rind. The sugary sweet fruit washes away the sour lemonade remaining on your tongue. Bright and hydrating, the watermelon also tastes like summer. The iced lemonade and the chilled watermelon have satisfied your craving for something cold. It is another warm, dry day, so you take advantage of any opportunity to cool down. When you put the glass pitcher and the leftover watermelon back into the fridge, the moist air escapes and cools you off even more. Rejuvenated, you stroll outside to face the heat of the afternoon. Lounging by the doorstep, a calico cat meows a friendly greeting. The shaded front porch is a popular place for the neighborhood cats. You stroke the long-haired cat and whisper sweet words of affection. The cat's fur feels comforting and familiar, like a warm hug. The lazy cat nestles against a wooden rack, displaying a colorful assortment of shoes. You take out a pair of faded sandals these light, breathable shoes are perfect for keeping your feet cool and comfortable. Nearby is a red rocking chair. The bright shade matches the red front door on the porch. Taking care not to lean back, you sit up straight on the rocking chair and anchor yourself to the ground. As you slip on the beach sandals, you feel a subtle cushion underneath your toes and notice the warm summer air on top of your feet. So as not to startle the sleeping cat, you quietly slide off the rocking chair and tiptoe towards the front yard. You immediately feel a pleasant sea breeze. The beach cottage is just a few blocks from the ocean. Even on hot summer days, the low temperature of the ocean generates a cool sea breeze, like nature's air conditioning. You take a deep inhale of the salty air and watch an old palm tree sway back and forth in the yard. This tall, majestic palm tree looks old and wise. While the tan trunk is lean and smooth, the thick green foliage is jagged. Camouflaged in the thick crown of leaves, a large bird of prey surveys the sky above and the land below. The bird's screeching is muffled by the rattling palm fronds. Peeking through the leaves, the stealthy bird reveals itself as a hawk. Then the sleek brown hawk catches a burst of wind and catapults high into the sky. Effortlessly hovering above the horizon, the bird appears weightless and free. 
you start to walk towards the beach, wondering what it feels like to fly. If only, you think. Across the street, you see some neighborhood kids gathering. They've just returned from the beach with their wet and sandy gear. Bright beach towels and waxy surfboards are strewn across the lawn. To have some fun and cool off, the kids spray each other down with a garden hose. Their youthful exuberance and spirited laughter are contagious. You find yourself smiling as you walk on. With no real plan, you head west towards the sea. It is one of those long summer days where the clock seems a bit slower. You can stray from your usual routine and take your time without any worries. The sidewalk is nice and shady as the street is bordered by huge pines. The dense green foliage of these magnificent trees blocks the afternoon sunlight. Strong brown branches extend overhead like a giant canopy. You feel and hear the soft crunch of fallen pine needles underneath your sandals. On your way, you stop to pick up a small pine cone. Squeezing its rough edges, you unleash a woody aroma. The smell reminds you of a sprawling forest. Holding the brittle pine cone, you take a deep breath and then tuck it away in your pocket. In the area where you picked up the pine cone, you witness an entire ecosystem. A red robin plucks twigs from the ground, while a blue jay digs for worms. Nearby, a bushy-tailed squirrel scurries through the pine needles to collect nuts. The gummy sap of a tree entices a speckled ladybird flying by. Nature is truly present everywhere. Feeling relaxed and mindful, you continue along the tree-lined sidewalk until it eventually ends. Leaving behind the peace and quiet of nature, you now enter the hustle and bustle of the ocean boardwalk. Bicycles cruise by, their wicker baskets overflowing with beach towels and sunblock. Speedwalkers move briskly along the boardwalk, wearing stiff baseball caps and wide aviator sunglasses. Enthusiastic beachgoers are out and about in every direction. You step onto the pedestrian-only boardwalk and go with the flow. In no rush, you settle into a pace that's slower than usual to savor the long, sunny afternoon. Besides, there's nothing you have to do today, and there's so much to see. Somehow, the ocean magically draws together 
different people of all ages in one place. Not only is the boardwalk buzzing with activity, but the sandy beach also feels festive. Sun lovers lounge and socialize on colorful cotton towels, while others swim and surf in the deep blue sea. And through the air, frisbees soar, balls bounce, and kites fly. There isn't a dull moment. Your attention turns towards a heated game of beach volleyball. You pause to cheer on a little girl as she triumphantly spikes the ball. Trying to convince you to join the game, the friendly group says they could use an extra player. You decline, but thank them for their gracious offer. Waving goodbye, you think of how wonderful a day can be when kindness touches it. The boardwalk gradually widens to accommodate a new row of pop-up tents. Local artists showcase their unique works of art in the hopes of making a sale. Inside the tents are displays of sketches, paintings, photographs, ceramics, and much more. Hunting for that perfect souvenir, curious tourists exchange pleasantries with the charismatic stall owners. You browse a tent packed with pottery hoping the unique pieces will spark some gift ideas for friends and family. The sun's rays shimmer off the smooth and glossy ceramic paint of all sorts of pottery. A couple of things stand out. A pair of forest green mugs and a set of brown dipping bowls. They're the perfect gift for just about any occasion. You would like to sip gourmet coffee or tea out of a handcrafted mug and dip something tasty into a decorative bowl. And you think others would too. You move along until you notice bright baskets hanging in another tent. The baskets are intricately woven with fibrous plant material, like jute, bamboo, and hemp. And they're naturally dyed with spices like turmeric for yellow, paprika for red, and cinnamon for brown. What a great housewarming gift, you think. The yellow bamboo basket would be perfect for corralling odds and ends. Crowds huddle around the other tents, so you continue along the boardwalk. Rolling back your shoulders, you straighten your posture and breathe the fresh air. How nice it is to be moving your body and expanding your mind. With every step, there is something new and inspiring to experience. Up ahead, an old pier stretches out over the water the massive pylons buttress wood planks to create an extended ramp. 
big waves crash against the sunken pylons. The pier is a beacon on the waterfront, standing out like a lighthouse. Situated along both sides of the pier are little white cottages, which serve as a quaint bed and breakfast. Each cottage has a square deck in the back and an oval porch in the front. As the tide rolls in and out, guests in these cottages truly experience oceanfront living. At night, the people who stay here are lulled to sleep by the waves. Once you get closer to the bed and breakfast, you can tell the old cottages have recently had a makeover. They've been spruced up by a fresh coat of white paint. Scarlet begonias and lavender lilacs are meticulously arranged in planter boxes beneath the window sills. Welcome mats and nautical images, such as boats and pelicans, invite guests into their vacation cottages. You make your way to the end of the pier and notice the new stainless steel railing. Fishing poles are attached to the shiny railing with clips and straps. Waiting for their lures to bobble and tug, fishermen sit back and relax. Buckets of freshly caught fish indicate a successful day. An elderly gentleman is in his element as he tends to his fishing pole. A chunk of seaweed latches onto his lure, but it doesn't even faze him. He seems mellow as he untangles the messy seaweed with ease. Chuckling, he mutters to himself that he will be lucky next time, and you can't help but agree with him. Standing on the pier, suspended safely over the water, you feel connected to the sea. Peeking through the horizontal slats of the stiff wood boards beneath your feet, all you can see is water. Cool and salty, a spray of ocean mist touches your face and drips off your skin. Immersed in your surroundings, you are filled with a sense of peace and harmony. In a calm daze, you rejoin the boardwalk on autopilot. Walking comes so naturally, and it's nice to zone out for a while. Your thoughts are quiet, and your body is relaxed. Effortlessly putting one foot in front of the other keeps you grounded and centered, helping you to stay in the present moment. You're not sure what the time is, but it doesn't really make a difference. From the looks of the sun hanging low in the sky, it's getting late. Before you call it a day and head on home, you decide to watch the sunset. You know the perfect place.
it seems that the other people are also ready for the spectacle. They're coming and going between the sand and the boardwalk. With the sky clear and the air hot and dry, the conditions are just right for a green flash. When the warm yellow sun melts into the cool blue sea, an emerald flash lights up the horizon. Everyone here is anticipating a magnificent green flash very soon. Walking comfortably, you soon reach a famous surf break where sunsets are exquisite. You take a seat on the concrete wall of the boardwalk and enjoy the sight of people surfing. Blown out by the wind, the waves are somewhat choppy, but still rideable. Having fun in the swell, surfers coast in and out with the movement of the water. The sun, now a glowing ball of golden yellow, begins to dip into the deep blue sea. Staring at the horizon, you witness a radiant flash of green just seconds before the sun vanishes. Feeling content and calm, you are ready to make the trek home. On the way, you reflect that the green flash is definitely a highlight of your summer at the beach cottage. This inspirational sunset resonates with you on so many levels. There are no words to describe the tremendous gratitude you are feeling. Your heartfelt reaction to the vivid colors in the sky is something that will stay with you forever. You leave the boardwalk and cross the dining district of the Ocean Boulevard. From corner to corner, eateries are buzzing. After watching the sunset, everyone heads here for dinner. Happy people linger in outdoor cafes and mingle at the bars. Others queue up in front of pizza restaurants and taco shops to order food on the go. An intoxicating smell of fruity summer treats permeates the air. The scent intensifies as you approach an ice cream parlor. An eager employee hands out free samples of their seasonal specialities. There is chunky mango sorbet, a blueberry custard ice cream, and a banana foster frozen yogurt. Why not try each one, you think? They're free after all. The first flavor to sample is the banana foster. You taste subtle hints of spice blended with banana in a vanilla yogurt. Next, you try the chunky mango. Tangy citrus bits covered in slushy mango swirl in your mouth. Finally, you eat the blueberry custard. 
the tart blueberries are mellowed out by the sweet custard. This smooth ice cream is definitely your favorite of the three. Once you've finished, you cut through the parking lot of the ice cream parlor to a quiet residential area. Dusk blankets the neighborhood and calms your mood. Colors appear blissfully muted in the low-lit sky. The fading light wraps a golden halo around objects and softens the edges. This time of day is ephemeral and fleeting, so you engage thoughtfully with the natural world around you. The hot, dry wind has now disappeared and the air is still. Singing birds have settled in the trees, while crickets chirp near the sidewalk. In lush gardens, the grass appears parched from the heat of the day, while blooming flowers close their petals for the night. As it gets darker, the last faint shadows disappear. Being present in the moment, you notice the small things. A little snail moves slowly across the gritty pavement. It must take this tiny creature months just to move a mile. How curious, you think, to carry your house on your back. The little snail seems vulnerable on the sidewalk. So, once it hides in its shell, you gently pick it up. Round and grayish brown, the shell rests safely in the palm of your hand. you find a nice manicured lawn to place the little snail. The snail is now sheltered from foot traffic on the sidewalk. The walk home is short and sweet. All around you, dusk magnifies the beauty of the outdoors. Reflecting on the day, you feel intense satisfaction and gratitude. A simple walk has cleared your mind, restored your body, and reset your attitude. The streetlights in the neighborhood automatically turn on after dusk. The red front door of the beach cottage and the old palm tree in the front yard are illuminated in the soft glow of a street light. Nearby, a black cat darts across the lit up street and into the dark of the night. After stepping onto the front porch of the cottage, you kick off your sandals and sink into the red rocking chair. As you sit here, you smile, noticing the lingering taste of the blueberry custard ice cream in your mouth. Sighing with complete contentment, you let the rocking chair cradle your tired body. As you swing back and forth, your legs relax and your arms rest in a comfortable position. 
you reach into your pocket to find the pine cone that you picked up earlier that day. Inhaling the woody scent, it's like being in a forest. The smell takes you back to the huge trees bordering the beach and the crackling pine needles underneath your feet. With these visions, your eyelids grow heavy. Each breath allows you to let go of the day and embrace the night. You focus on your breathing and on relaxing your body. You are now feeling so sleepy, you can no longer stay awake. After a tired yawn, you give in and slip into a peaceful slumber. <laughs>